We are constantly in a rush. We are just focused on getting things done. We get up in the morning and hurry to get ready for school. We are racing against the clock. We want to have everything done yesterday. We can no longer imagine life without a coffee machine. We don't eat much breakfast because we have no time. We hurry through the day. No matter how much we have to do, there is never enough time. Today almost every phone has internet access. Wherever you are, you are constantly checking the Twitter feeds, sending emails and looking at your friends' photos in Instagram. All our social life is today in our Facebook profile. We have chosen a good school, a good university, a good work, because everybody does this. We every day go there and sit there without interest. We prefer to spend time on social networking rather than be working on studying. We want to get home as soon as possible. When we come home from work or study, we just collapse on the couch, bed or chair near the computer because we're exhausted. We have no desire to move and don't want to do anything. We live like in Groundhog Day, and every day in our life plays out exactly as the day before. Hi, and what's up? What? Test? I will come soon. You're always in a rush. Why do so many people feel that so many things have to be done right this moment? Why do so many people feel they need to be everywhere two minutes ago? Ask yourself, is your work better if you're trying to do 10 things at once or if you really pour yourself into one important task? 
Is fruit better if you cram it down your throat or if you savor every bite of it and really appreciate the flavor? So maybe you're going at the wrong speed. Maybe when you constantly rush, you miss something important in your life. Is it a fair price for you? Sometimes, life gives us a chance to stop even for a second and just look around. It doesn't always happen the way you expect. Life chooses the simplest, but at the same time the most effective methods to wake you up. Usually they look like a slap on your face. This slap helps you open your eyes and see the reality around you. Life is beautiful and full of kind people that can help you through every season of it. Notice it. Notice the shining sun, the bumblebee, the small child, the smiling faces and happy people around you. Stop staring at your phone or computer, go outside. Your time spent with a friend is better if you can relax and really focus on the person. Not just when you have a rushed meeting interrupted by your emails and text messages. There is no reason not to be outside when the weather is just right. Do sports, spend time with your loved, or just walk through the park. Do everything that can make your day a bit better. Give freely to the world gifts of love and compassion. Don't be indifferent when someone needs a helping hand. Do not concern yourself with how much you receive in return, just know in your heart it will be returned. A day without love and laughter is a day wasted. Find the one who will make your heart smile. Life seems completely different, exciting and worthwhile when you have someone to share it with. Every day you run somewhere and don't even notice the beauty that tourists admire. Every town and every country are amazing. Try to find some time for traveling around the world, because when you stay all the time in the same place, it is like you are always reading the same page of a great book. The song is much better when you take the time to really listen to it, not just skim through it. And I give up forever to touch you Cause I know that you feel me somehow You're the closest Stay for a second. Feel the sound. Dance like nobody is watching. Hi. Can we meet today? Okay. Life as a whole is better if you go slowly and take the time to savor it, appreciate every moment.